action. Well, what a pleasure on thedailybeast.com. Six time, six time US Open champion, Chrissy Everett. Chrissy, what a tournament. I want to reflect a little bit. First, let's talk about Melanie Udan, someone that a lot of people are comparing to you. Do you see that similarity? Um, I see the similarity as far as um, she's short. <laughs> and um, uh, I think that she's very consistent. You know, she doesn't make a lot of errors. Does you know doesn't really have that one big weapon, but she knows when to go in for the kill, you know, pretty well. But she's she moves a lot better than I ever did. She's a, she's great mobility, and um, you know, I think we'll see what happens. You know, she had three big wins, but really, let's see what happens. Hopefully, she'll go home and and not sort of get want to get a lot of attention and try to work on her game a little bit more. Well, what is it like for you to come back to the US Open after these, after so I, many I, years of winning it? I love it. I, I, this is the only Grand Slam that I come back year after year and I bring my boys and I bring my husband and um, you know we get to sit in great suites like this, the USTA, and, and I, I really enjoy it and it's, uh, it's, a, it's a way for me to keep in touch with the current players. Well, on an unfortunate note, last night everyone's been talking about Serena Williams and what happened with their match against Kim Kleisters. What are your thoughts on that? Um, well, I'm sorry that it happened. I mean, I'm sorry that she got foot faulted at such a crucial time in the match, and I'm sorry. You know, I feel uh, I, I'm was disappointed the way she reacted to it. I, we haven't seen that that really a reaction from Serena before, and it was you know it's verbal abuse. So you can't really you know um, say that that was an okay thing to do. But um, you know, everybody's human, and she I'm sure she's gonna if she just admits that she made a mistake and she's human and she was just so um, had so much passion at that point she just let it go and um, hopefully you know she can get it behind her and everybody else can too. And what do you think of Kim Kleister's coming back after having a child and a layoff in the finals of the US Open? It's a pretty great story. That's a great story and I you know I, when I saw her play this tournament I thought she was playing better than when she was playing before she had the child and when she had won here and I'm, I was shocked at how she was matching Serena and even hitting deeper and hitting harder and just matching her shot for shot. We haven't seen a, a woman like that in so long, uh, besides Venus, who could challenge Serena like that. So, I mean, I, I think it's it's a great story, and um, I don't know I don't know how she does it. I, at, once I had my first child, I was so in love with that child that I had nothing left over for my tennis. So kudos to her that she can do both. Well, Chris, ever thank you very much. Six time US Open Not champion. Not in a row, though, like Roger will do. But <laughs> Exactly. Good point. On thedailybeast.com. Thank you, Chrissy. Thanks.